Hello everybody, Hunter here with something a little different today. Past month we've been playing Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, we just finished that two days ago. Yes, that's right, I actually took a day away from content creation yesterday. So we're back today to play some Persona. It dropped the same time as Rebirth, I really wanted to play it, but I didn't want to play two things at once. So here we go, we're going to jump into this, this is a remake of a very old game. Let's see, are we just stick to normal for now? It's totally fine. If it gets too easy, we can always increase the difficulty. Yeah. Here we go. So something about Persona games and me, I've played them all. I put a lot of time into the Persona series, but I've never actually managed to finish a game. They are so long and there's always a lot of other stuff comes up at the same time. Let's hope it changes with this game. Don't have a lot of memories of Persona 3. I remember a lot of the transformations. I was crazy. Wow! It looks great. Normal for this. Today's train schedule will be modified due to a rail switching malfunction. We apologize for any inconvenience. The next stop is Iwatodai. Iwatoda, Iwatoda. This is the final train bound for Tatsumi Port Island. Please board before the scheduled departure time. Totally normal, totally normal. <laughs> this is looking awesome. I have arrived so late, I better hurry up. Iti Taudai Dome. That's where I'll be staying from now on. It should be just up ahead. Yeah, it's totally normal. He's <laughs> not affecting him whatsoever. Check. Better keep my distance. Looks a little dangerous. Hey, vendor machine. Can't interact with him yet. Okay. Hey, did that pop up too? Or is it the same thing? Looks like the entire station is undergoing construction. Okay, let's continue. Is that a coffin? It is. Are we on a head to dome, shall we explore more? Looks like these stairs lead to the second floor. It's late. I should really head to the dorm. I haven't given you any more control in this area then. Nope. No little secrets to collect around either. Alright, let's go. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> this doesn't affect him so casually woken. <laughs> I guess this is it. We made it. And I see this building a lot in this one. Would this count as a remake or more of a remaster? Welcome. Hey, actual voice lines. You're late. I've been waiting a long time. Wow, the character model art is amazing. If you wish to proceed, sign your name here. It's a contract. There's no need to be scared. All it says is that you accept full responsibility for your actions. Enter your name here. Should I do my name or should I start typing Joker? Let's do it. Here we go. Oh, you can't do that. Nah. Oh, wait, you got first the second name. Ah, Joker Joker. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Go with this. Yeah. Good. Time is something no one can escape. It delivers us all to the same end. You can't plug your ears or cover your eyes. And so, it begins. Who's there? here at this hour don't tell me you're a boy <laughs> wait huh the lights i didn't think you'd arrive so late my name is mitsuru kirijo I'm one of the students who live in the storm. Who's he? Love the music. He's a transfer student. It was a last minute decision to assign him here. He'll eventually be moved to a room in the boys' dorm. Is it okay for him to be here? I guess we'll see. This is Yukari Takeba. She'll be a second year this spring, just like you. Call me Takeba. Nice to meet you. Why do you have a gun? Is this the girl's dome? Huh? Well, uh, it's sort of like a hobby? I mean, not a hobby, but... You know how it is these days. It's for self-defense. It's not a real gun, of course. It's getting late. You'll find your room at the end of the hall on the second floor. Your things should already be there. Why don't you get some rest? Oh, I'll show you the way. Follow me. Pretty easy to remember, huh? Since it's all the way at the end here. Yeah, very convenient. Um, do you have any questions? What's that contract for? Does that kid live here too? 
Um. Huh? Contract? What are you talking about? Kari doesn't seem to know what I'm talking about. Uh, can I ask you something? On your way here from the station, was everything okay? What do you mean? You don't know? I guess that means you're fine. Well, okay. Don't worry about it then. I'd better get going. Later. Um... I'm sure you still have questions, but let's save them for later, okay? Good night. Night. And here is our room. The texture of the wallpaper isn't the best, but I think all the way into the character models. Life in the dorm starts today. The dorm came pre-furnished and everything. I'm spent. I should put my things in the closet and get ready for bed. You can save your progress in this game by pressing the options button. Save in <laughs> possible whenever options is displayed on the screen. By saving the game in the network slot, you can upload save data online instead of saving it to the console. Okay, okay, I guess a lot of save data stuff. When you save the game, it's also a little bit of a, your past. You can go back to that time. Okay, so if you make a mistake in choices, you can rewind and change your choices. Ooh. Don't think I'll do it because it's kind of, kind of cheating, but I will you know, it's cool. Alright, that's why I wanted me to go in the closet, I guess. But I didn't have all, no, nothing like that. Check mirror, let's check myself out. I see a tired face reflected in the mirror. Okay. I should probably rest on the bed. Everybody tell me to rest. I'm tired, I'll watch it another day. The calendar hangs on the wall. Yeah, let's go to bed. Sleep near bed will allow you to advance forward in time. Yeah, I know. I should go to sleep, so I'm ready for first day of school in the morning. Wow, kept this 2009. Go check myself out again. It's Takeba. Are you awake? <laughs> Could have a walk in on me. Good morning. Did you sleep okay? I've been asked to show you the way to school. If you wanna go ahead, loving the music. Are you ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready. I can find it by myself. Yeah, I'm ready. Great, let's head out. And this is how we'll be getting to school every day. It's a monorail. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, I honestly love the ride here. It almost feels like we're flying over the ocean. Oh, by the way, our school's at the last stop on this line. It's called Tatsumi Port Island. Have you heard of it? The whole thing's man-made, and our school's smack dab in the middle. Oh, look, there it is now. So pretty. Good morning. Well, here we are. Allow me to welcome you to Gecko Khan High School. I hope you like it. You'll be okay on your own from here, right? Let's see. I guess you should go see your homeroom teacher first. The faculty office is over there on the left. They'll tell you more when you get there. Thank you. Well, that about does it. Any questions before I go? Which class are you in? Not really. Me? I don't know. I haven't looked at the classroom assignments yet. Hey, about last night. Don't tell anyone what you saw, okay? See you. More I saw. What an awesome soundtrack! There's a crowd forming in front of the bulletin board. 
Maybe I'll take a peek before going to the faculty office. Use R to rotate camera, press R3 to recenter the camera. Hold up to focus your view closer on the protagonist. By pressing down it will reset the camera. In some locations the camera will be locked in place. Whenever it's available, use the camera will okay. So if I do that, uh, yeah. I can zoom in. Come on, let's talk to students. There's no need for them to post their names of kids who are gonna be in our class. I mean, we'll never see them again after we graduate anyways. Okay. Oh. There it is. Class F, huh? Homeroom teacher is what? Miss Toriyumi? I guess she is older than me, but I was hoping to be with Miss Kano. Ah, so some of it is voiced, some of it isn't. Oh great, I have the worst teacher ever. What? I don't see my name. What should I do? What should I do? The name is added on a small note as I left. Class 2F Joker Hunter. Hmm, the name Yukari is also on the list. It seems that I'll be in the same class as her. Anybody else to talk to? What? Cuz, what are you doing? Why are you wearing a jersey? Uh, what do you mean, why? We've got practice after class, remember? But we've got to attend the opening ceremony and go to class before all that. Hurry and head into your classroom so you can change into your normal uniform. What? But I just... Okay, okay, fine. Just quit glaring at me. So where's the bulletin board with all the class assignments? It's literally right there, Cause. You're in class F. I'm in a different homeroom, so I can't keep an eye on you all the time. You got that? Good grief. Kids these days don't know how to show respect for their elders. We're their teachers, we've lived longer than them. But Moriyama and her friends had to pull that on me at the very beginning of term. See you. I'm sorry to interrupt, but I need to get back to managing the shop. <sighs> Even you're shooting me away some way to start the school year. I don't think my nerves can take this. Oh dear. Alright, alright. You want me to order some of those cream filled breads you like so much, right? You could have just asked. Anything else before we head in? Ah, the fuck the officer. Um, I think it's that way. Actually, I'm new here. You should probably ask somebody else. Listen closely. A true man should always carry the fiery soul of a samurai. Definitely recognize these pair. Our school curriculum nurtures the samurai spirit within our students so that they contribute to society. Oh la la, hmm. how wonderful. I wish to set my soul on fire and learn the ways of the great samurai also. That's what I like to hear, my boy. Though you hail from a foreign land, the samurai spirit burns within you all the same. Huh? The library? Strange. I even made sure to check the map, but... Where am I? Ah. Nurse's office. This seems to be the fact the office should I go in? Enter. Oh, are you the new student? Huh. Hmm. You're a second year, correct? Wow, you've lived in a lot of different places. Let's see, 10 years ago, your parents... I'm sorry, uh, I've been so busy, I didn't have time to read this beforehand. I'm Ms. Toriyumi. I teach composition. Thanks, nice to meet you. 
<laughs> What's your first name? Nice to meet you. Wow, such enthusiasm. Have you seen the classroom assignments? You're in 2F. That's my class. But first, we need to go to the auditorium. The welcoming ceremony will be starting soon. Come on, I'll show you the way. And so, another new school year is upon us. I'd like each of you to remember the proverb. If a job's worth doing, it's worth doing well. When applied to student life, this means... The principal continues all of his speech. on this morning, right? I saw you two walking together. You must be pretty close, huh? What's the deal between you and her? Oh, and uh, does she have a boyfriend? <laughs> Nobody seems to know. She does, she doesn't, I don't know. <laughs> ah, man, I knew it. I mean, why wouldn't she, right? Wait. How close are you guys? <laughs> Who's that? Someone's talking. Yeah, sounds like it's coming from Miss Toriyumi's class. Hey, shh. Be quiet. You're gonna get me in trouble. You are. What do you want? Me? Call me Junpei. Junpei Yuri. I transferred here when I was second year in middle school. Pretty tough being the new kid at first, you know? So I just wanted to say, hey, see what a nice guy I am? Didn't think we'd be in the same class again. <laughs> there you go again. Acting like everybody's best friend. Try not to make him uncomfortable, okay? But I was just being friendly. If you say so. Anyway, who'd have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? Yeah, I know. It's just a coincidence. It must be fate. <laughs> I don't have the courage to say this right now. Maybe I could say stuff like this without hesitation if I was at least determined. Anyway, who'd have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? I know, but still, I was a little surprised. Um, uh, hello? Are you forgetting I'm in this class too? <laughs> anyway, I gotta ask. I heard you guys walk to school together. What's up with that? Come on, give me the dirt. The dirt. Huh? What are you talking about? We just happen to live in the same dorm. Why do people always jump to conclusions? Have rumors been spreading about this already? Oh, I'm worried. You didn't tell anyone about you know what, did you? You know what? I didn't. Okay, good. Seriously, don't say anything about last night, okay? Oh. <laughs> what? Don't get the wrong idea. Listen, I just met him yesterday, and there is absolutely nothing between us. Jeez, I have to go now. There's something I need to take care of for the archery team. You better not start any more rumors. Ah, who cares? No one takes rumors seriously anyway. She's so paranoid. But hey, 
It's your first day here, and people are already talking about you. Believe it or not, she's actually pretty popular. You're the man. Well, here's to a fun school year, dude. You ready to head out? We can walk to the station together. Let's explore a little more before I head out. Yo. You should... Should we also take a look around the school while we're at it? I'll just follow you around if you want to leave, head to the front entrance. Cool. New school years, uh, tough. New teachers, new classmates, it's exhausting having to start over every year. Oh, you're that transfer student. You're gonna join a club or something? Well, club activities suck anyway. You have to socialize and be considerate to, of other people. I guess it's just a good way to make new friends, but I also just want to enjoy high school, you know? Don't you feel completely lost whenever you're a transfer student to a new school? This is a second floor. And the one below has a faculty office, club rooms, and more hands-on classes. If you go down either of the two staircases, you'll be able to reach the front entrance. Thanks for telling me! <laughs> hey, new kid, you have no idea how lucky you are. You're surrounded by cute girls and 2F like Takiba. Alright. Yeah. If you're trying to leave, you gotta go down. <laughs> They love telling me this tutorial. Go. Look at that guy peeping through the window. There he is. <laughs> peeping in. Alright, let's have a look around. Oh, did you just transfer to our school? Right, well, just so you know, the only person I'm interested in is Kijiro. She looks so stunning at today's welcoming ceremony too. Just because it's a new school year doesn't mean that students should be running wild. It's up to me to reinforce order. That is, once I've officially become a member of the disciplinary committee. You think so? You're making such a sour face again. I guess some um, things will never change. Did you hear? The new transfer student's gonna be in 2F. Oh my gosh, what if he turns out to be really cute? Wanna go steal a peek? Oh yeah, apparently he's staying at <laughs> Iwatodai Dome, the one Takuba is staying at. But isn't it kind of weird to transfer schools as a second year? I wonder if he's a troublemaker at his last school. Do you think we can go upstairs yet? Let's check the roof. Nah. Okay, okay, I get it. We can't go up there yet. Before heading down, let's have a look around. Anything more? Oh, you're leaving now? You you know how to get back, right? Don't go teaching Hunter any weird stuff, alright? <laughs> yeah, 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 catch you later. You can tell how fashionable a person is by how they wear their school uniform. I'm gonna brush up on the latest trends to show off my best self. Huh. The store leads to the courtyard, which leads to the gym, or was it to the practice field? I'm so confused. What do you want? I'm a little busier. I just gotta text all my new friends I made today. What mobile are they using? As the flip phones, the old Motorola razors. Very popular after the old Nokia's. These classrooms are so are also used for club activities, not just for lessons. Typically, if the culture clubs that use them, but they don't seem to be accepting new members right now. Anyone else? Welcome. Hi there, welcome. Oh, oops, sorry, habit. We're still setting up shop today. We'll have a white selection of products ready, so come back another time if you want to buy something. 
Yes. Oh, it's you. Be careful on your way back. I'll be heading to the dorm as soon as well, so don't stay out too late. I couldn't sleep last night because I kept thinking about school starting, so I came to the nurse's office to nap. But that nurse gave me some weird medicine instead. I turned, I turned it down because it looked really gross. Only a brave soul would dare drink something like that. Nah. All right, main it. Main entrance it is. I think we talk to everybody we possibly can talk to. Go. Ready? Let's get out of here. That's right. Let's get going. Jocks on their run. Say, you thinking about joining a club? Oh, wait. New members gotta wait a while before they can apply. Your stop's at Iwatodai, right? Forms, man. Must be nice. Talk about living life wild and free. Well, I'm going this way, so see you tomorrow. Say ya. Everyone's excited because school's starting, but I don't really care. The news has been really weird lately. I even saw some policemen around here earlier. Okay, so that's the one that gives us all the gossip. We received a call from this area. Is everything okay? Uh-huh. Not this again. It's the same as that weird syndrome that's been reported all over the news. Can you interact with these now? Yeah, you can. It's a vending machine. There are drinks I've never heard of before. Maybe I'll buy some next time. Of course. Of course. Anyone else to talk to before I head off? Oh, guess a new school semester started. I was wondering why I've been seeing so many students around. The world's a strange place these days. These kids better prepare themselves for the future. Oh, are you a student from a school around here? Well, you'll be glad to know you can get some quality sushi close by. I make it right here. Drop by sometime if you want. Oh, actually, our shop is still under renovation. Sorry. Dearie. We are a bookstore, not a sushi restaurant. I'm sorry, he always is like that. Awesome. <laughs> there are so many great shops here, I can't tell, but swing by. Oh, uh, I'm out here for, for work right now, so I'm um, not slacking off or anything. My friend has a cat, and it's so cute. I'm not allowed to have one though, so I just try to get my fill of cats by looking at strays. I want to eat some takiyoki. Okay. Ah, who are you? I'm not allowed to talk to strangers, sorry. Oh, another one to talk to. Excuse me, back here. Hey there, kid. Haven't seen you around these parts before. Our takoyaki's lip smacking good. You'll be asking for more before you know it. Ah, uh, before going there, let's see if there's anywhere else to talk to. Anyone, anyone at all? Use the town map to navigate your surroundings and move from one location to another. Visit as many spots in town as you can and they'll be added to the map. The next is the dormitory. Have we been to the port island? Yeah, we did. We did. Is that the same kid? There are all kinds of shops here at the <laughs> strip mall. If you're craving delicious food, then head to the Wakatsu. There's also a Hagakuri, a famous ramen shop. You can also find dessert here and burgers and... <laughs> Sorry, I'm just going on about food. Yes, it's eating time.
That uniform, you must be a student at Gekugan High. That's nice. Do you live in a store? It looks like Gekugan High went through a rough patch a while back, but it's been rebuilt into such a magnificent building. Oh, never mind me. Enjoy your new school semester this spring. Everybody's so nice. Should I go back into the dorm now? Welcome back. How was your first day at school? Not too bad, Tyron. Yes. I see. Well, don't hesitate to ask your classmates for help if you need it. Oh, apologies. I didn't mean to make you. I didn't mean to keep you here. You've had a long day. Go get some rest. By the way, it's strange just to go out on your own at night. Please refrain from doing so. Besides, you must be tired after today. You should make sure to get some good night rest. Isn't it like on day three, I believe, all the like combat and transformation stuff happens? Oh, welcome back. What are you doing? Nothing, just looking around. Not much. How about you? Um, just killing time, I guess. Well, you're probably pretty tired after your first day, huh? Maybe you should go to bed early. My room's the one on the end. Can we go to the roof here? All the way up. Now it's the top. Okay. Name's a uh, attacking bear. Yeah, let's go down to my room then. Oh wait, there is another staircase. Okay, there is. door is tightly sealed. What's in this room? I can see a conversation bubble, but we can't enter right now. There's a notice on the door. Do not open. If open, close it. Okay. Go down to my room. I got a fridge now. Your room's fridge. It's the fridge. There's nothing in particular that I want to chill. That I want to chill right now. Okay. <laughs> Must be a translation error. If you want to go ahead. I'm going out for a bit. Hmm? Have you seen the newspapers lately? There's a lot going on. I know. Severe cases of apathy syndrome are suddenly developing in people who showed no symptoms prior. It's been quite a topic of discussion. They say it's due to stress, but... Yeah, right. It's gotta be them. Otherwise, it's not worth my time. You have a one-track mind. Will you be okay out there on your own? Don't worry. I'm just getting a little practice. This isn't a game, Akihiko. Okay. I can hear people talking. Have you heard? The rumor about the uh... What was it again? The bathroom? Hold up. <laughs> That's old news, besides, it's just a ghost story, not a rumor. You're talking about that one girl, right? The second year? She stopped coming to school and just sits around staring at walls all day long. Whenever her mum tries to talk to her, the only thing she says is, It's coming, it's coming. Is that really how the story goes? Ah, eh, whatever. It's probably all made up anyway. Some disturbing rumour seems to be spreading around the school. The 
first bell is rang. Okay, time for class. Open your textbooks and we'll take a look at the first novel by Zenzu. Ah, uh, why him? I've been more interested in Tota work lately. Okay, Tota Kenaku's work lately. His essays are fantastic and he also has a famous haiku poet. I wonder why all this isn't in the textbook. Well, I guess I'll just bring his book next time. Speaking of haikus, they often use words or phrases relating to seasons, but it's easy to get them mixed up. For example, you'd think tasty bamboo shoots and vivid carp steamers would symbolize spring, right? Well, they actually related to summer. Haiku poets usually refer to seasons based on lunar calendar, making it fairly complicated. Hey. Lori, are you listening? Here's a question for you. Among these phrases, a rain of flowers, mystical mirage, a vivid carp streamers, <laughs> which one symbolizes summer? What? Uh, what? Huh? Psst, Joker. Were well, you listening, right? Lend me a lend a brother hand. Okay. So there's only three now? What symbolizes summer? Exactly. That's right. So you were listening to me after all. By the way, mystical mirage and the rain of flowers represent spring. A mirage is a natural phenomenon that occurs around late March to early June. And the rain of flowers refers to spring showers around the time a cherry blossoms bloom. It's not literally raining flowers. Make sure you remember all that on our next topic is... <laughs> well, you know how much I like to pay attention. You're a lifesaver! Man, seriously, you saved my bacon, Joker. And to give him the answer just now, he must have a good memory of something. I can cure my classmates whispering. I've become slightly more popular. Woo. Stat increase. More charm. Class has ended for today. I should head back to the dorm, but not before talking to anybody, right? Let's have a look around. It's Itu I it's Iwa to die strip mall. It's bustling with activity in the afternoon. I have no idea how to pronounce all this stuff by the way, so sorry if I'm wrecking it. <laughs> I barely speak English. Oh, he's back. So, this is our new guest. Good evening. Good evening. My name is Shuji Ikutsuki. I'm the chairman of the board for your school. Ikutsuki. Hard to say, isn't it? That's Ikutsuki. why I don't like introducing myself. Even I get tongue-tied sometimes. Please, have a seat. I apologize for the confusion regarding your accommodations, but it may take a bit longer before you receive the proper room assignment. Is there anything you'd like to ask? Who are you? Who else lives here? The other night I saw dot dot dot. There are only four students in this dorm. You, Takeba-kun here, Kirijo-kun, and a third year named Akihiko Sanada-kun. I hope you all get along. Do you have another question? Why are you here? To welcome you, of course. You don't mind, do you? Speaking of which, Takeba-kun, have you seen Kirijo-kun by any chance? She's upstairs. As diligent as always, but it couldn't hurt to come down and say hello. Is there anything else? Just one more. You saw 
Something strange? Like what? <laughs> you were probably just tired. I wouldn't worry about it. Something doesn't seem right. Any other questions? Nah, I'm good. Excellent. Here's to a wonderful school year. Now, if you'll excuse me. I'm sure you're worn out from all these formalities. You may want to consider going to bed early. As they say, the early bird catches the bookworm. Right. <laughs> Get it? Bookworm? <laughs> because your students... You love that joke. Uh, clever, isn't it? It's okay. <sighs> You'll get used to his lame jokes. I guess I'll head back to my room, too. Like the chairman said, you should get some rest. Transferring schools is a real pain when you're not used to it. Good night. Night. I should listen to them and go... I should listen to them and go rest in my room. Okay. Hello there. So, how's he doing? The spying on me sleeping? He went to bed a little while ago. He's currently fast asleep. Size them speakers, damn. Mr. Chairman, do you think he's... Well, let's wait and see for now. The dark hour is approaching. Come on, what do you say? I can't leave a pretty girl standing around in the cold like this. Mm, what do you think, Naomi? I mean, I'm cool with it, but if my parents found out... You don't need to know. Just drop them a text. It'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Uh, it sucks. <laughs> I'm serious! I was scared yeah, shitless! Right. Nice story, though. That was the Bayside Rockers, brought to you by KJ. Cool. And that's all for tonight, folks. Yeah, Tune in again next week, same time, same place. <laughs> the program you just heard was sponsored by Kirijo Electronics, bringing the future to you. The time is now 12 a.m. 12 a.m., here we go, the dark hour. It's totally normal, dude. Just ignore it. What the? Totally normal. What's happening to me? Hamoon <laughs> <laughs> isn't exactly round, is it? <laughs> I know, it's a bit flatter on one side. Hmm, he's still sleeping. The dark hour occurs every day at 12 midnight. You could say it's the hidden hour. During this time, an ordinary person transmogrifies into a coffin and is oblivious to all that occurs. Then he must be... As you can see, he's retained his human form. He may be asleep, but he's definitely experiencing the dark hour. The only question that remains is whether or not he has the potential. Though, come to think of it, he must. If he didn't, they would have preyed on him by now. Scary. In any case, we should continue to monitor him for a few more days. Yes, sir. I feel kind of bad, though, spying on him like this. Good, it's super creepy. Oh, they changed his face. Huh. My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Elizabeth, 
She's a resident here, like myself. Pleased to meet you. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Only those who have signed the contract can enter this place. That's the document I signed at the dawn. From now on, you shall be welcome here as a guest in the Velvet Room. You were destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my assistance to do so. I only ask one thing in return. Abide by your contract and assume full responsibility for the choices you make. All right, I don't understand. Is this a dream? <laughs> Why not? Precisely. You are fast oh asleep. My god, the, the music transition then. Wow. Speak. I love this. this I do love video game music though. A dream. However, you will come here of your own accord, sooner or later. Hold on to this. Oh, I love this. Until we meet again. It feels like I had a strange dream. It's time to go to school. Morning. I'm so sleepy today. In times like this, the best course of action is to sleep during class. That adrenaline rush you get from dozing off right in front of the teacher can really spice up your dreams. I know what you mean. Don't sleep in class. Oh, you think so? Whoa, you, you take studying pretty seriously, huh? But it takes real courage to sleep in class, you know? Then again, since I'm not listening to the lecture, I'm pretty much screwed later. Oh, but we have classic literature today. That means we're stuck with Mr. Nasty Old Ekuda. Ekoda. Is it Ekoda, right? Me and my bad reading. Now, moving on. Mr. Ikoda, I'll be your classic literature teacher. We'll be learning all about good old Japan through some truly great stories. Exciting, right? Now, some people say classic lit isn't relevant anymore. But, oh, are they wrong? The students and other teachers, they don't know what they're talking about. Nobody really understands. It's... It is. It's like they should. <laughs> Why did I have trouble reading that? <laughs> I'm feeling sleepy. All right, dude. Should I close my eyes for a few minutes? Stay awake. Close your eyes. Stay awake. Close your eyes. Stay awake. Good grief. Hey, are you listening to me? Let's wake up, shall we, children? Now open your textbooks. First on your syllabus is Il's Monogatari. The origin of Japanese literature. It is a very interesting story. You youngsters might call it the bomb. <laughs> Say, <laughs> I can tell you, you people are zoning out, Tommy. I force myself to stay awake and listen to the lecture. Stop somewhere on the way home. Where I'm busy. Where? I don't know. Maybe grab a bite to eat. That's right. You're new around here. No worries. I'll show you. It's just around the corner from here. Let's go. This is Polonia Mall. Whenever I hang out with the guys from school, we end up coming here. 
There's a karaoke box, an arcade. Oh yeah, you can rent out CDs too. And there's that club over there. This is very 20 years ago, right? <laughs> Not that I've ever done it myself. Why the teacher says the bomb. This place may not look like much, but I'm not complaining. Let's check out the CDs first. Oh, whoa, that's new. I gotta try this. Let me show you my mad crane game skills. <laughs> ah, damn it! Oh, come on, man. I am not leaving empty handed. Dude, I'm gonna look from the side. Yeah, that's it, yo! One more try. Just one more. I hung out with Junpei for a while before heading back to the dorm. <laughs> Crane game man, I understand. Welcome back. You're pretty late. I don't mean to be overbearing, but. Please don't make this a regular occurrence. Well, in any case, you look quite tired. Why don't you go to bed early tonight? L1 will be displayed on your current location and shortcuts that will allow you to fast travel. That's new. When this is displayed, you can open the town map directly from the shortcut selection screen. Some shortcut destinations or even shortcuts itself may be unavailable in certain situations. Huh. Let's see. Cool! This is totally new. I don't remember this at all. Network. Not detected. Save game. Right, everybody, I'm be ending the video here for now i'll continue here in the next video where i believe i believe in the next part is where the combat will begin and i'm super looking forward to the transformation so yeah <laughs> bye everybody thanks for dropping in hope you enjoyed i'll see you tomorrow in the next one that is if you enjoyed so yeah bye all take care bye